months, us at Copters have helped over 100 survey businesses enable them to use drones within their survey workflows. This can be anything from uh, topographic surveys, volumetric surveys, creating uh, site progress reports. To have a bird's eye view of a site is a really useful tool for uh, shareholders and project managers to be able to look and view and, and to make informed decisions of what's happening. Today we're going to be looking at the Phantom 4 RTK, which has been out for a year now and has been a very popular drone for people and survey businesses wanting to start using drones for some of their survey applications. So, the Phantom 4 RTK has been out for just over a year now, and it's used in all manner of survey applications. It's very familiar, you'll notice that it's based on the Phantom 4 Pro, which is very successful with the survey industry. But what you get in with this is a more uh, refined survey tool. So you get an inbuilt screen with a really great uh, mission planning software on it, which covers pretty much all your needs for any uh, mission planning, with it being linear missions, 2D missions, uh, double grid missions, sorry, um, or single missions. And it's all contained in a small box, which can be easily put in the back of your vehicle and taken to on site. So there's two, two ways of processing the data from the Phantom 4 RTK. You can either use the base station, which comes with it, setting up over a known point. Now you will have to uh, establish this known point by other survey means. Currently the DJI base station uh, doesn't have this facility, but it may do in the future. Or you can uh, use a correction service network like VRS Now or like a SmartNet, and insert your details into the uh, settings on this and actually get real-time connections from um, a cause network. Alternatively, you can use your own base station if you have one, but this facility will have to, um, this process will have to be used uh, PPK. Currently, there's no um, DJI workflow for this, so you will have to use other third-party programs. So there are three different ways you can process the data to get um, down to sort of 30, 40, 50 mil um, absolute accuracy. So what you can achieve by using drones on site, you can save between 60-80% time on site by collecting mass data at a rapid speed. Now this data can be used and put into a, a software package like Pix4D, which we provide at Copters, to be able to produce things like point clouds, author images, DXF files um, for CAD, for creating uh, contours. So in terms of uh, where drones are a really useful tool for essentially one flight capturing mass data capture at speed, you can actually uh, produce multiple deliverables for the end client. So if any of this is sound and appealing to yourselves, what I suggest you do is give us a call at Copters. Uh, we are a full-scale enabling company uh, for survey and construction businesses. I'm a surveyor by trade myself, so I can help with any assistance and support you might need to get the most out of the drones. So we can provide everything from the training, the drones, sensors with that being high-end photogrammetric sensors like phase one cameras or LiDAR. We can also provide the software and training with this, which is PIX4D, almost become a bit of a standard in the UK for surveying construction businesses wanting to process that data. And most importantly, we're on hand for the support which you'll need to get the most out of it. So if you want to make a successful in-house survey drone programme, then contact me on the details below or send me an email.